What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video. Now as of recently, I have had numerous requests uh, from you guys basically wanting to see my sniper rifles. Now you guys know for absolute months, probably I don't even know, for once year two actually came into play. I just could not get a decent year two sniper rifle. The only decent one I had was on my Hunter and that being the Steel Piercer. I know there was a quest for the 1000 yard stare which I actually did and deleted, not knowing that the sniper was going to be decent. Um, many months later, I'm grinding these packages, trying to get a decent sniper rifle, and I just could not get one drop. Now, over the past month, I have had an array of snipers come my way, and I mean an absolute array. Some This may make some of you guys a bit jelly, and to be honest, when I was in my current state about a month and a half ago, I'd watch videos, people opening packages, getting these 1,000 yard stairs, these are long balls with these amazing rolls and I'm thinking you lucky motherfucker and I myself was jelly and I apologise if you guys cannot get uh, a decent road sniper rifle I mean it always gives them to the noobs like me uh, it's just the way it is you know the way get, uh, destiny works the noobs get all the good shit it's just the way it is now I'm going to show you guys uh, all the snipers I have and what am I doing and uh, I've got as you can see, all of them here, right here. Now you can see I've got one, two, three, four, five long balls. I've had five long balls drop. I keep getting them now, they just keep coming. And I've had a few that I've deleted because of the rolls of shit. Uh, but these are half decent. I've got one, two, three, where Lone's Marsh. This is the Iron Banner Sniper Rifle. Actually better than you may think as well, seeing as his impact's quite low. But in headshots, this thing's stability, it's rate of fire actually pretty good and I've got one 1000 yard stair which hasn't got the best roll but it's still pretty good now I'm going to show you guys uh, the roll I've got on each and every one of these nothing amazing not not the best roll as, as you guys would probably say but quite good quite good as you can see I've got um, ambush on this one which is a great site we've got grenade here which is a shitty roll, not, not gonna lie. We've got quick draw, we've got hand laid stock, and we've got reinforced barrel. So I've got, I've got, I've got range, I've got stability, and I've got a quick draw scope as a uh, quick draw thing as well. So not bad. And I've also got spray and play increases the reload of this weapon when the mag is empty, which is a great roll. Uh, well, great perk. Sorry. Next up, we have my way long. Actually, let's go through the the long boss first. Why not? This one here, we've got. The Longview SLR10, which is a great scope, and we've got the Ambush. I don't know which is better at these two, to be honest. If you guys can help me out, I'd probably prefer the Ambush, but I know you can't use the Ambush with Hidden Hand. It has something to do with the, the Aim Assist box. So I'm not sure about that. I was told it, so I just don't rock them both. But Longview and the uh, Ambush, probably the two best scopes, I believe. We've also got Last Resort. Uh, this weapon handles and reloads faster when a wielder is the last player on their fire team. Now I don't really play Trials of Osiris much, but I can imagine this is a great perk for those that do. Um, we've got Quick Draw, we've got a Rifle Rebel for that range, and we've also got Old Frame for Reload. Quick Draw again, and we've also got Spray and Play again. Incre increases the reload uh, speed of this weapon when the magazine is empty, so yes, not bad again. And uh, Next up we have... Um, we've got the Texas SLS15. Now I think this is one I I planned on using um, for PVE, but I'm not sure why I've kept it. To be honest, I mean, I think got a great, great scope. We've got I, I know what this is. This is the first long bolt I got. That's why I've kept it. This is definitely the first I got in a package about a month and a half ago. We've got a last resort, quick draw. Injection mode for that stability and reinforced barrel and firefly. Now, if this had the ambush scope, I'd love this. I'd I'd, I'd use this all the time, but it hasn't. Because um, I do want firefly and a decent sniper, which I can use in PvP. Next up, we've got um, short gaze. SL. I think it's a short gaze scope, which is the best actually. I could have been wrong. Short gaze. Uh, ambush and there's that other one I just mentioned, which I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember. I think the short gauge is the best one. We've got Army of One, quick unassisted kills with this weapon, reduced grenade and melee cooldown. We've got perfect balance, we've got injection mode, and we've got old frame. We've also got hidden hand. Is it's hidden hand and ambush you don't use at the same time because something about the the aim assist fox up. I said that earlier, but I'm not certain what that is. But yes. Uh, was that the last of my no, I've got one more. And this is another long. I think this is the one I actually used most. 
I'm not sure actually, I can't remember. I've got so many of them, I don't know what the fuck I use. I've got Ambush on this one, and I've also got the Long View as well. We've got Army of One, Speed Reload, Snapshot, and Reinforced Barrel with Hot Swap. So that's not bad at all. Now let's check out my 1000 yard stare. Okay, so we've got Short Gaze, and we've also got Tech. So Short Gaze, yes, obviously. We've got Gorilla Fighter, which is a horrible perk. Speed Reload, Reinforced Barrel, Demotion, and Mulligan. A great, great actual mod that is. Uh, Mulligan, Reinforced Barrel, and Short Gaze. That's actually not a bad roll, to be honest. Um, what have we got here? The Extra Solar RR4. This is the Dead Orbit Sniper. We've got Longview, Ambush. We've got Triple Tap, which is a great, great... Uh, well, actually, people who can hit headshots, because I got hit headshots for shit. But yeah, for people who can hit headshots, I can imagine this is a great mod, great perk for you guys. We've got skip rounds, we've got snapshot, and we've got small ball. We've also got hidden hand as well. I ain't rock yet. We've also got hidden hand as well. You may have seen that in one of my montages, my fuck about montages in PvP. Actually, get some decent kills with that, to be honest. Now we've got my first of three, Way Lauren's March. Um, we've got. Long view, and we've also got ambush with triple tap, hand laid stuck, reinforced barrel, and outlaw. That's actually a decent roll as well. It really is. Probably the best that I've actually I've seen so far uh, out of my collection of snipers. This one we have, well, you can see the short gaze scope. We've also got, also, yes, short gaze, um, last resort, armor piercing round, snapshot, oiled frame, and unflinching. Not bad either. And the final one we have is Ambush SLH25. We've got Partial Refund, Perfect Balance, Reinforced Barrel, and Atlo. You know what? That's an amazing roll. That is an amazing roll. If only that was a longbow. I'm not sure actually. It's got more aim assist. I'm sure it's got more aim assist than the longbow. I'm actually pretty certain it has. But yes, guys, they are my well, that's my collection of sniper rifles. For those of you who wanted to see it, what do you think about them? Let me know down below in that comment section. Also, let me know as well what perfect, well, your best roll sniper rifle, what it is, and the role you have on it down below. But guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Do drop a like. I do appreciate the support. If there's any other weapon class collection you want to see of mine, let me know what it is down below in that comment section. Thanks again for stopping by, and I'll catch you on that next one. Peace out. Until next time. Peace. in the wrong, knowing where we stand, but you and I will carry on, we never get it right.